is up you guys it is me cutesy and in today's video I am going to be showing you every single pet coming to the fossil egg this Saturday in adopt me if you want to come to my live stream when this event happens make sure to press that red subscribe button and turn on all notifications for the channel let's get into it <laughs> Okay, so in order to access the Fossil Isle Excavation event, you need to click this button on the left side of your screen and let's teleport to Fossil Isle. For those of you who haven't completed the tutorial yet, make sure that you talk to Tom. Okay, so you guys know, um, for those of you who have done the tutorial, that you have to come over here and grab a brush. Um, so in order to earn these fossils and figure out what pets are going to be available, you need to make sure that you are digging in these like piles of dirt and bones several times a day. So I believe you're allowed to do it twice a day. Once you talk to Henry, he will show you pets that are coming to adopt me this Saturday. And today we're going to be doing a review of all of them. So now that I got my two fossils, let's talk to him. Quick little like um, hack here. If you keep pressing down on your screen, it makes him talk really, really quick. So yes, since I just finished digging up every single fossil that I am able to, I can show you guys every single pet that is coming. We should also talk about the accessories and things you get, but we're going to talk about that later in the video just so that we can get into it. So the first pet that you can get is the ground sloth. Um, and then you also have a Tasmanian tiger. These are your two common pets in the jungle in the jungle egg cutesy that was like months ago <laughs> the fossil egg so here is what the ground sloth looks like it looks like a modern day sloth but like has a longer body and a much longer face um, these things are super duper cool there's the Tasmanian tiger which looks unlike any other pet in adopt me so far it is absolutely adorable and I really want to like get a ride potion for one of these that would be so cool um, the neons for these, I would assume, would have white markings because they have the brown color scheme with some white on them. I assume that when you make them neon, they will be white marked or like what is neon is going to be white. So this is going to be super pretty. I really want to make some videos on like the neon versions of everything in these eggs. So you guys, if you are interested in that, please go ahead and leave a comment down below. Also leave me a comment suggesting other things that I should do once these eggs come out. So now that we have looked at the common things, let's go ahead and look at the uncommon things. Sorry, I'm kind of spoiling a little bit here. So for the uncommon pets in the egg, you have a Triceratops and a Stegosaurus. These two are probably some of my favorites just because they are so detailed and super cute. Um, they are absolutely adorable. I love this one, like the coloring. Oh, you also have this guy. I literally didn't even know that, but let's, let's look up Glyptodon. All right, so I'm looking this up. Um... So they kind of look like armadillos in a way. Okay, yeah, so you say it like Glyptodon. You have the Glyptodon, Triceratops, and the Stegosaurus that are all uncommons coming to these fossil eggs. I'm super impressed with what the team put together um, for this update. It's all really cute. These little guys are so pretty and super bright. Like, I'm sure that the neon version or the mega neon would be beautiful. So those are the uncommons. Next up, we're going to be looking at the rares. As you guys can see, there is a woolly mammoth, which is like really really cute probably one of my favorites as well um we have this guy oh my goodness that is that is a cute little thing here okay so we have the woolly mammoth dilophosaurus and then i don't know what the other thing is so let's let's see what he looks like um i think it's like a pterodactyl if i'm if i'm incorrect here i, I apologize let's see what it is yay it is a pterodactyl okay so the woolly mammoth and pterodactyl are probably some of my favorites just because like they are so unique and so cool so for those of you who are like trying to compare some of these pets basically the woolly mammoth um is like a regular ele elephant or a modern day elephant um we're gonna use the tusks that we received in this event just to like show it off but the woolly mammoth has some like thick hair um and it's textured and it's brown so it's it's pretty cool the pterodactyl isn't like any pet we have in the game it is a flying pet which is super exciting um so if you were to buy a ride potion and ride it it would be flapping its wings as you rode it which is really awesome i'm super excited for all of these i'm sure that they would look awesome when they are neon or mega neon so i'm really excited for these eggs you guys if you are excited for these eggs, make sure to smash that like button or if you're just enjoying the video so far. 
So next we're going to look at the ultra rares. So these guys are really cool. That looked like a dragon. The saber tooth tiger is so cool. Like, oh my goodness. It kind of looks like the Tasmanian tiger, but a little bit different. It's it's really cool. Um, so we have two ultra rares. This guy is, I don't even know how to explain it. It looks like a bird and a T-Rex. Like, oh my goodness, how cute is that? The ultra rares are kind of cool. Honestly, I, I feel like these are some cool creatures, but I kind of like the rares the best so far. What about you? guys okay so the ultra rares are awesome i'm not gonna go too in depth because next up we have the legendaries so the two legendaries that are going to be in the fossil egg are the dodo bird and the t-rex obviously the t-rex is the most iconic dinosaur out there um it's just super cute and i cannot wait to see this in like a mega neon version so basically we've had some other eggs before and they usually have two legendaries so that is um pretty usual for this egg. I really want the dodo bird. I think that's probably my favorite thing in this entire uh, collection of pets here. And just a reminder, there is a live countdown in Adopt Me right now above these pets. So yes, make sure that you get your quest done and unlock these pets to see what they look like before the egg comes out. Okay, you guys, so now that we've looked at all of the pets, let's go ahead and head on off to the nursery to talk about some other eggs and the pets like rarities and how much we think they're going to be worth value wise all right so you guys the current egg in the shop is an aussie egg um a lot of people are asking like should i buy aussie eggs or should i save up for fossil eggs well here's what i think this is my personal opinion i think that you should get a bunch of aussie eggs now while you still can because these are not coming back these are super exclusive and they've been in the shop for like eight months so if you think about it, eight months in the future, these are going to be worth a lot, <laughs> like a lot. So make sure you stock up on these before it's too late. Um, we will have several months to get the new eggs, you guys, so do not worry about that. Now, the Aussie eggs um, only have one legendary in them that you can get, and it is the kangaroo. Oh, yeah, I forgot I dressed him up. <laughs> um, but, yes, the kangaroo is the only legendary that you can get in the Aussie eggs that are in the shop, you guys. So if you want to get some of these kangaroos without having to trade for them, make sure you go unbox some Aussie eggs or just stock up on them for trading sake or value sake. Okay, so I am obsessed with the Aussie eggs. I'm a little bit sad that they're leaving because they had some cool pets and they like introduced me to a new culture with all kinds of pets. But um, we're going to look at the values of this stuff or I guess the pets that are coming in this Saturday. So I think that the commons are honestly really, really awesome for a common pet. Like, they did so good at designing all of the pets in Adopt Me that are coming this weekend. Like, it looks awesome. The commons look like ultra rares. Like, I'm so impressed with the team. Um, I don't think that these are going to be worth, like, a crazy amount because they're just pretty general, like, dinosaurs. Um, the rares, honestly, I hope are worth a lot because these are adorable. Now, you guys remember the safari egg, the very first egg to ever come to Adopt Me in that machine. Um, we had elephants, and these things are worth a lot now. I actually have enough to make a neon I kind of want to do that but um these are worth a lot now and just the longer time that has passed after an egg comes out the more the animals or whatever in that egg um gain value so it, it's really cool you guys I love this whole system that we have going on um <laughs> I don't have like any legendaries like I need to start trying to unlock some of these but um I definitely see the dodo bird being worth an insane amount after the um fossil egg leaves adopt me or even while it's here along with the t-rex like I said the t-rex is literally just like so iconic so um this is gonna be quite an interesting update you know we're just gonna have dinosaurs roaming the streets of adopt me totally normal right all right you guys so that is all that i have today make sure that if you enjoyed this video you smash that like button in the face and tell youtube what's up okay and if you would like to see some of my future videos i do all kinds of stuff i stream updates i do overlook bay tea adopt me tea royal high all kinds of fun stuff so if you want to become part of the cutesy crew make sure to subscribe if you want to make it to my next live stream aka this live stream and the Overlook Bay Halloween update, make sure that you turn on all notifications for my channel. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you guys have an amazing day. Thank you guys, bye.